That's my and Bialik and our co-stars Kyla Pratt and Leslie Jordan in the Fox series. Call me Cat. Please welcome my and Bialik to the show. <laughs> Hi. Hi, so nice to see you as always. Wish you could have been in person, but this is nice too. <laughs> also nice. <laughs> so that was uh, you, of course, with your Call Me Cat co stars, including Leslie Jordan. Uh, He's so funny, right? How much fun is it working with that guy? He's very funny. I mean, he is one of those people who just everything he says sounds quotable or like <laughs> it could be a little book of sayings by Leslie Jordan. You'd have to bleep him a lot if he spoke on camera the way yeah. he does off camera. Right. Um, but he's he is. He's a lot of fun. And and honestly, our, our whole cast, we really we have a great time playing together. It feels like the best high school theater class ever. <laughs> is it true you end every episode dancing? It's like a dance off or a dance party. <laughs> is it true? And how did that come about? That's fantastic. So our show is actually based on the BBC show Miranda, and that was one of the things in Miranda, this was like even before Fleabag, she would break the fourth wall, and so she would wave. And so that was something that our, you know, our creator, Darlene Hunt, really wanted us to do, and it's become kind of a thing. Uh, we, we choose music, you know, for every episode, and we, um, you know, we do a variety of waving or something from the episode, and yes, often there's dancing. Nice. That's the best energy. Right Wait, there. what's what's your go-to dance move, Maya? Um, the white man two-step, of course. Because <laughs> <laughs> you can't go wrong. And there's also this like rib cage thing that hey, Kyla and I do. Hey. I don't know. That's what comes to me. That's like an old school cabbage patch. I, I like, like that, that right there. <laughs> Maya, earlier uh, in the season you had a little uh, blossom reunion on set. That's cool. We How'd that come did. about? Um, you know, Fox is, it's their job to like try and find fun things. And um, they asked, they were like really nervous to ask me. And, you know, Mario, I think you can relate. It's like, I can't distance myself from the thing that a lot of people know me from. It's okay. Sure. So I was like, sure, I'll, I'll text Joey and Jenna and Michael. And um, they were happy to do it. It was really fun. Um, you know, it kind of felt like having my my siblings come to work you know i wanted right. like them to be comfortable and like make sure they like the craft surface you know i wanted them to be happy there. <laughs> what great. are some inside jokes played out when the blossom cast come i heard y'all were like making fun of joey or all this just pure oh, we all, stuff. i mean that was our thing we always made fun of joey <laughs> so we just we made fun of joey they all collectively teased me um you know we have our things we, we grew up together you know for five years we were each other's junior high and high school um, we were each other's social group, and it was really special. You know, we still give Joey a hard time for being Joey. They still <laughs> yeah. give me a hard time for being a feminist. Like, all the things. <laughs> I love it. Well, you, of course, were teenagers on the show, Maya, and cut to your sons are teenagers now. Wow. How time flies there. Your oldest is uh, 16, correct? He is. is he, let me ask you something. So is he fired up about driving? Because I feel it's different. With like, as opposed to our generation, we couldn't wait to get a car. But now, if I was growing up now, I'd be fired up about having an Uber all the time and not having to drive. Well, that's the thing. Like, you know, he's like, I don't know. It's COVID. Where am I going to go anyway? I was like, to drive to the supermarket if I need some milk? I don't know. Yeah. Go do something. Um, but yeah, he's really into cars. Like, he loves sport. We both do. We both love sports cars. But he knows I'm not getting the Lamborghini that he thinks he deserves. <laughs> so I think he feels like... If I can't have a Lamborghini, what's the point? No, um, but he is, he's taking his classes and, you know, I learned on a stick shift, but like there are no stick shifts good, anymore. Good so you. we'll have to rent a car and destroy it. I'm kind of having a great time with the process, but I think it might just be denial. Like, <laughs> I just can't believe that someone that I grew in my belly is now sitting behind a car and is taller than me. Like, it's just freaking me out. Uh, Maya, tell us about the Jeopardy National College Championship that so you're hosting. Cool. Uh, we have 36 students from colleges all over the country, you know, everything from Ivy Leagues and public schools, historically black colleges, colleges and towns you may not have heard of. And it's 36 really, really exceptional, fun young people. I call them kids because they're like my kids age. Mm. Um, you know, if you if you feel ridiculous and like you don't know any answers on regular Jeopardy, watch 18 year olds blow you out of the water. Right. Uh, we had a great <laughs> time, though. You know, it's like we did it like a March Madness bracket, basically. Um, so they yeah, it was it was fantastic. And categories are a little more fun, a little spicy, a little more current for their generation. Um, and it was really just great energy. I mean, I love going to work at Jeopardy, but having these young people, it was, it was fantastic. We had a great time. So much fun. Well, we have a little rapid fire game for you. And instead of answering 
questions, we, we are going to give you the answers and you give us the questions, okay? Remember, must be in the form okay. of a question. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. The one food you can't resist. What is dark chocolate? Here you go. Oh, I am. Trader Joe's, by the way. What oh, is the right answer? I love dark chocolate. Yiddish word that sounds dirty, but is it? What is <laughs> Wait, I, what does mean? I love it. So it. It literally means stuffed, but it is a euphemism for sex. Oh. I want to I want to all day long. Yes. Uh, the strangest place you went on a date. What is the cemetery? <laughs> what is the what? Did you with the cemetery? Oh, the cemetery. <laughs> Dang. Wait, more on that later. Yes. And last one, the strangest place where someone yelled, yo, Blossom. What is a drunken frat party at UCLA? <laughs> hey. Where there's a lot of going on. A lot of Ah, it's my new favorite Maya, word. Maya, always great to see you. Thank you for my really new favorite great. word. And you can watch Maya host Jeopardy Maya. National College Championship starting Tuesday, February 8th at 8. And Call Me Cat airing Thursday nights at 9 on Fox. Up next, Queer Eyes Jonathan Van Ness has a new <laughs> Netflix show. And he's here to tell us all about it. Coming up next. <laughs> great job.